I've been brainwashed to sub to do the John's reactions. <laughs> Yo, 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 what's up, everybody? It's your b -b 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 boy. Do, do, do the job. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like the video, please hit that sub button if you haven't already. Hit that notification bell to let you know when I post another video for you guys. And hit that like button. And if you like video game content, check out my video game channel, Do the John Gaming. Link is down below in the description. Let's get into the video, shall we? Yo, this is 10 mysteries involving YouTube videos. Can we solve a mystery? Let's find them out. You or I watch a YouTube video. We usually don't know all the events surrounding its recording, but as these videos show, what YouTube can be used by just about anyone or anything. Number 10. This YouTube channel is just a random string of letters and numbers that may or may not spell out some sort of hidden message. There's one video that's especially strange. Someone is furiously pedaling around a neighbor while panting. Apparently lost and possibly being pursued. The next video is of someone watching two other people from afar and from behind some shrubbery. I'm not sure if this video is real or not, because they would obviously be able to see this person from this angle in my opinion, but maybe they were just ignoring him or truly didn't notice. If the person filming here is the same person that was on the bike, then I think they may have serious problems. After not posting for over seven years, the channel started uploading content again a month ago. Maybe the now there will be more clues revealing the mystery behind these videos. Before we go any further, it's a proven fact that generosity What the fuck? Generosity makes you a happier person. So if you're generous enough to hit the subscribe button and the bell beside it, then thank you. Thank Number you, nine. Jenlar Sebastian Diamond is a YouTuber who appears to be calling out some sort of high-level corruption, though I have no idea what he means. The first video he ever made is extremely hard to understand because he is mumbling something while holding his ID. Then he plays some text-to-speech program for a minute that unfortunately also makes little sense to me as well. Today that children, their mothers, fathers, and young girls are being severely mistreated. Almost all of his videos start with him showing his ID and then playing the text-to-speech program outside of his window or in various public places. There's little context to go off of which somehow makes these videos even stranger. Even his ordinary trips to the grocery store somehow seem creepy as he slowly photographs everything that he is buying and the receipt like they are all important evidence. Judging by the number of mysterious videos he makes every day, this dark issue must constantly be on his mind. Number 8. YouTuber Nick Soderegger, also known as Sunspec ran his channel for years with it gaining some attention in 2014 for his dance videos. Sadly, in September 2018, he disappeared after hearing a woman screaming at 2.30 in the morning outside his residence. If that wasn't strange enough, since that day, he has never been seen again, and the mystery surrounding what happens remains unsolved. His family has set up a website which will be linked in the description, with a $10,000 reward for information leading to his whereabouts. Number you hear a girl screaming at 2.30 in the morning. Uh, and you went after it? After her? At 2.30 in the morning? If you think you're going to call... Uh, call the cops. First. At least. I don't know. I would call the cops. And wait for the cops to show up to go investigate. Because that, obviously that girl screaming was like... Bait. Number seven. A 
I hope he was found, eventually found. YouTuber named Baklava Girl 95 claims to have found this weird tape in the back of an impounded car after buying it at auction. Hi, I'm Tony. I'm 36 years of age, five foot ten, and I'm looking. The footage appears to be an old homemade videotape of someone named Tony who can barely keep it together. Tony appears to be making a dating service video of some sort. As the tape wears on, it becomes apparent that someone else is in the room with him. Uh, Judging yeah. by her whimpers, it sounds like the poor person may be there against her will. Just Another part of the video looks like it was- What the fuck? ...is taken through someone's window without their knowledge or consent. Tony goes on to claim that he is a professional photographer who has worked all around the world. He asks for any women who find him attractive to send their personal information to his address, including their name, age, really? home address, and phone number. I can't tell if this tape is real or just a really good piece of amateur acting, so let me know what you make of this. As much as I hate to admit it, it looks like Tony could be a vicious madman who was never brought to justice for his heinous actions. Yeah. Number six, a YouTuber named Guy Terry hears someone crying outside of his door and starts recording for both evidence and his safety. He quickly shuts the door and then appears to be torn between helping the stranger and running away. He decides to open the door once again. A bad mistake. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. What the fuck? What the fuck? Something about the timing of the video and the aggressive posture of the woman seems absolutely real to me. First uploaded in 2007, this video... I thought that was something in there. I wasn't quite sure what it was. Video is one of the earliest ghost sightings to go viral. I'm not sure if this was truly paranormal or if someone broke in, but I do think it's not staged. Number five, my dark. Ch it could be staged. It could be, but he's quickly has to close the door like he's like it. It was almost feels so authentic, but. Uh, I don't know. Journal is a collection of abstract videos that many people are certain contain hidden messages and deeper meanings. Perhaps even clues about a woman who lost her life. The latest video, simply called Wither, starts off with a snowy lamp post and ends with a strange woman walking down the stairs. In the description is a link to a video on a completely different YouTube channel. This video, called Whisper, has images of evil looking building schematics and what appears to be some type of old language. I don't expect anyone to really be able to translate the words on that last page, but I'm hoping that someone can. Anyway, in the description box of the Whisper Freaky. video, is a link to yet another video on a YouTube channel called The Oracle of Lies. This third and final video is called Wayne. It shows an old desolate road and more weird imagery, including the same mysterious woman from the first video with her. I'm not sure if there are any hidden messages in any of these videos, but there certainly could be. No fourth video is linked, and the odd trifecta ends there. This could be a simple art montage, or it could be the real thing. Maybe even something from the depths of the dark web. If you are able to make sense of any of these videos, even just a single part, then please let me know what it all means. Number 4. There's a YouTube channel called The Zeroeth Folio of Shakespeare that posts nothing but weird Shakespearean quotes in a low, menacing voice. <laughs> Somebody has been posting dozens of these videos for over a year now despite most of them having only 5 views or less. I don't really understand what these videos could possibly mean either. individually or when put together. All I know is that it's almost like whoever is uploading these videos is on some kind of mysterious mission with a hidden purpose that I doubt is benign. 
Anyway, here's where things get really weird. The right side of these videos has always shown static for the past year, but at the end of their latest video posted four months ago, the static suddenly what clears the and this scary event happens. I also noticed how the thumbnail for this video looks different than the others, further adding to the mystery. All of the other thumbnails show the same image of static, but this newest one clearly shows a strange looking man wearing what appears to be clothing from another time period. Take a look at the channel and let me know if you think this is just a clever gimmick or some kind of nefarious creation loaded with hidden messages. Number 3. Who knows? A YouTuber named Benjamin oh, Bennett makes videos That's where he guy. smiles for literally hours at a time. No one knows why he does it. Maybe it's performance art or maybe he is a little unstable. Either way, videos of a man smiling at you for hours at a time are deeply unsettling. First of all, I wouldn't watch more than a minute. Not even a minute of a guy just sitting there smiling. I wouldn't. Then, one day, Benjamin Bennett frowned. I think that maybe his facial muscles were cramping up after hours of smiling. Or maybe he was playing a practical joke on us. Other viewers, however, are sure that Benjamin Bennett is being held against his will and is being forced to smile by someone off camera. Let me know which explanation you think is true based on what you've seen here. Number 2. This channel was uploading the exact same video for 4 entire years straight. Then after 4 whole years, it randomly uploaded this creepy video as of September 2018. As far as I can tell, there's no practical reason for anyone to be doing this. Almost all of the videos had received less than 4 years in just as many years. I have little doubt that the designer of these videos has some sort of malicious intent because the entire video collection just feels off, especially the latest one. It could be loaded with hidden messages about doing who knows what. Also, I noticed this string of binary code in the description box. If any That's developers weird. think they can crack it, then please let me know what it says because I'm really eager to find out. This mystery will probably never be know, solved because all of the videos have been deleted. And if you go to the channel, it simply says this channel does not exist. Before we get to number one, my Freaky. name is Chills and I hope you're enjoying my narration. Are you curious about what I look like in real life? Then go to my Instagram at DylanIsChillinYT to find out. Do you like my narrations? If you answered yes, then tap the follow button and thank you for your support. To show my appreciation, a different follower gets shouted out every day on the Chills Instagram. My music video for Who Am I Now has been uploaded but do not watch it. Please, please, please don't. Also, don't forget I upload a new video here on YouTube every Thursday and Saturday. Number one. Oh, I get it. You're not gonna fool me, chills. Telling somebody not to go watch something is gonna make people wanna watch it. WebDriver Torso is one of the few YouTube channels that continues to stay creepy even after being supposedly debunked. A number of years ago, this channel was discovered uploading videos that were all rectangles and frequencies. What the hell? Oh, oh, ah, my ears. The videos are somewhat mesmerizing to watch and many people claim they will lure you into a strange state of mind over time. Google has since come forth with an official explanation that this channel is used only to test video quality. But this is a really vague explanation and plenty of people are convinced that this is a cover-up story for something more sinister. Uh, Meanwhile, yeah. the videos have only gotten longer and are now up to 25 minutes and one second oh in God. length. Also, one day in 2013, WebDriver Torso uploaded this strange video seemingly for no reason at all, further adding to the mystery. Pretty. As to exactly what this means, your guess is as good as mine. This channel could be anything from a video quality testing site like Google says, 
to a mind control experiment or even an AI program gone rogue. Also, if you can explain this channel's rather cryptic name to me, I'd definitely like to hear your best guess, though I really doubt anyone can. To have I've been brainwashed to sub to do the John's reactions. <laughs> oh my god. That oh, the last one I don't I I don't know. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video and you are loved.